Okay, folks, this is my London session trade. I went in during price action while it was inside of the Asian range. And I'm going to keep the price very basic. Nothing, no indicators. All I want you to do is train your eye by watching price right here. And this is sped up a lot. And I want you to see as price trades down into optimal trade entry. I don't want you to look for the Fibonacci. Okay, I don't want you to look for that to be a crutch. In the beginning, it's okay to use it, but I want you to be watching price without it, okay, and train your eye to be able to see it. Okay, we're targeting that previous day's high, and we're creating our impulse swing higher, taking out a short-term high. Now, we want to see it retrace and go lower. Not interested at price where it's at right now. You want to catch it as it drops down. And I'm going to highlight the order block and the optimal trade entry at the same time when they converge right there. Watch. That's when it hits that level. Bang. See that? It's picking up orders. Okay, it'll go back down again and gather more orders. Okay, you can see price hanging around. At short term high it just broke not the previous day's high but the short term high that would cause a shift in market structure that would be bullish okay now you're gonna see price eventually make its way towards the previous day's high because there's buy stops above that high and we're gonna see how price expands and starts to gravitate towards the previous day's high okay one more time in there and it'll bump through that previous day's high there you go you can see it run through it now okay nice little pop through that now by itself that's not a lot of movement it's not a lot of run on price but it's the same thing done on higher time frame charts so what we're seeing here is the element of price action and the ebb and flow another expansion through the previous day's high okay and that in itself right there is enough for a intraday scalp that would, that's all that would be necessary so looking at what price has done here now obviously it's not a lot of movement it's not a great deal of magnitude no one's getting rich off of you know 20 pips or so but when you can see it and you can outline it and anticipate that on a short term uh, perspective like this the same approach is just applied to higher time frame charts and it requires a lot more time that's all it just requires more time for the position to come to uh, a profitability